Guys, we finally done it, and in this video, we're gonna show you how to play Saints Row 1, the OG Saints Row 1, on PC, baby. It's finally possible, and it's working great. AP. We finally did it, guys. We can play Saints Row 1, the OG Xbox exclusive, on PC. We finally did it. Thanks to an emulator and a couple of talented people in the community. I want to give a special shout out to the people who made this possible. The people who made this project possible to play Saints Row 1 on PC are Brooklone and Turvel. I only spoke with Brooklone. He told me everyone who was involved in this. Shout out to you people. You are one of the best people in the community as it comes to mothers and everything. Thank you for making this possible. Now, into before we get into this video, I, I know man. You really want to play Saints Row 1 on PC. You really want to play it. I'm going to show you in this video tutorial on how to play it, on how to play this game. I know it might have been childhood for you. might not own a console and really want to get back into the game. You maybe don't like Xbox. You maybe only have a PlayStation and are sick of the fact that you can't play Saints Row 1 on PC. Well, I'm here to show you how to do it very easily. Easy installment, easy steps. And you can finally enjoy Saints Row 1 on PC thanks to those amazing people. So, I'll uh, roll the tutorial, just watch the steps, very easy to follow by the way, and uh, I'll show some gameplay to see how it performs. But before we start, I want to say, if you want to play this game without, let's say, APS drops like below 15, you should have a, you should have like a GTX 1080, maybe a TI1, and an i7 processor, and at least 8 or 16 gigs of RAM. DDR4, in my opinion, are the best ones for this. My specs are on ATX 2060, 6GB. An i7 8600 coffee cake, lake, <laughs> and uh, 60 games of RAM. Yeah, nobody cares about the motherboard. <laughs> Sorry, motherboard. So, yeah, guys, this is what you need to, to, to get in order to play. So, just watch the steps and let's enjoy some scenes together. Sure enough, we'll begin play at the end. And yes, it isn't crashing. No crashes. The only crashes I had seen my stream were because my controller disconnected. And in order to play this game on PC, you will need a controller. And you, sh you should, if you have an Xbox, it's okay, but if you have a PlayStation controller, I'm gonna help your ass even more. So let's watch the video, the tutorial, and get this game working. Okay. Alright, this is the tutorial. So, I'm gonna leave you a link to get this file. But before you get this file, please, show some love to the Discord of the people who made this mod. Show some love to the Discord. Link to the Discord in the description. If there are problems, go to the Discord. Talk to the guys. Let's build a community around this Discord. I don't own the Discord. I just like the people around it. And I consider it will be a nice way to show respect to the people who made this possible by showing the Discord and letting people join. So join the Discord. Link in the description. Alright, so in order to get this file, I'll leave a link in the description as well. And uh, all you have to do to install this, watch these steps maybe. Create a folder called let's say saints row one pc okay you have your folder open the folder you have your files also the f this file saints row one xenia zip man you should use a seven zip on it uh, the winrar doesn't work on it if, or, uh, at least for me so anyway you have these files hold on you have these files called license portable and saints row links in the description for them you just have to copy them here Man, the music, I see the music right now. <laughs> OG times, baby, OG times. So yes, wait for this to copy. Wait for them to copy. It's gonna take, depending on your PC, it's gonna take how long it's gonna take. Fast forward. All right, baby, we got it. We got it. We got all the all the files. You know, we got all the files here. And now, um, if you're an X, if you own an Xbox controller, just plug it in and play. 360 or one. Just plug it in and play. There we go. It loaded. See? Just wait a bit. Then go to file, open. This is the folder. Since we're on PC, where you will get the updater, everything. Go to Saints Row. 
and select default.xax. Double click it. Press F11. And you got it. But if you have a PlayStation controller, there's another thing you should get done. Or a basic controller. You search for DS4 Windows if you have a PlayStation 4 controller. If it's the it's dual shock for the PlayStation, you just change to uh, the PlayStation 3 one. Click on download now. Uh, click DS4 Windows.zip. And again, open it. Of course, it will be called We Found the Two. I already done it a couple times. So just open with zip. You have these two files. For the sake of playing it, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna leave it. I'm just gonna leave it. Um, hold on. I'm gonna leave it in the same folder. Now, I already have this program. And if you have a PlayStation controller, you might have some issues with uh, DS4 Windows. Alright, so let's get into DS4 Windows. You say, uh, pick the program you want to program folder, add data, program folder. And it should connect to your uh, to your controller. But many people have this issue where it doesn't find the controller. So let me help your ass a little bit more. So if it won't show you the ID on the PlayStation controller, no problem on DS4 Windows. This is what you have to do. Go through here. Search for control panel. From here, go to device and printers. There will be a controller here. I have already one. It's, it's detected. Go to properties. This one, he ID complement game controller. Go to properties. Go to change settings. And from here, you press uninstall device. Accept everything is going to show. Disconnect your controller, uh, close your PC, reboot it, disconnect the controller, then connect it again. And you will see that it will light up, it won't be like the, the that color will be blue and it will be connected and it will be found in the DS4 Windows one. This is another tutorial in one video. So after everything is done, you got it homies, you got it. What you have to do to play is click on Xenia, wait for it to load. Trust me, you have to wait the first time. After that, um, it's just emulation, you know. All I have to say is that you gotta wait. You have to wait. There we go, it loaded, see? Just wait a bit. Then go to File, Open. This is the folder, since we're on PC, where you will the update or everything. Go to Saints Row, and select default.xax. Double-click it. Press F11. And you got it. Just remember the controls as an OG. You, B is whatever, C, you know. Then BAM. You know, start a game, baby. Start a game. And you can finally... Oh, look, it's me. And you can finally enjoy Saints Row on PC. Now I'll leave you with some gameplay I got. As you can see, I got four in the story. So, yeah, that's, that's it. <laughs> You got Saints Row on PC, fully working, fully working, no issues whatsoever. Watches, watches, I got watches, yeah man, we all got watches. See how great it performs? It's amazing. It's amazing, look. Look at this, it's going so well. Get up. Check me out, undercover baby. Undercover, undercover, undercover baby. Check this out. Actually, the jersey should have been black. That's all I want to say. But at, at least I'm representing the scenes. So you can get more respect while I'm at it. Oh, you want to go with shotguns? No problem, homie. Check this out. Shotguns. Dance, baby. This is the last dance for you. Give me your money.
kill these guys as well. And pick up their weapons. Before they disappear or something. Nope. Oh, it, he isn't dead. Oh, they came. What a sniper! What are those weapons? Bro, chill. You die. You guys really are lieutenants, man. Vice skins remaining six. It's gonna be fun. Should we? I didn't even know I had that gun. <laughs> oh, you guys are aim messing up, man. RPGs, you guys are RPG gameplay or something? Girl, give me that. Huh. Oh, man. Alright, baby. You're gonna die. And they got some fine ass weapons from this stronghold. So, I hope you guys are happy. We finally got to play this one on PC. A lot of times. Shout out to the mothers to be only this possible because they are amazing. So thank you for watching this tutorial, this video about Sims on PC. I'm gonna play it with live streams. You're gonna see constant live streams from me playing this masterpiece on PC. We're gonna finish this game together. So why not subscribe? You know what I mean? Why not subscribe in case you're new? So shout out to everybody who watched this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it, if it helped you. Subscribe in order to join the family in case you didn't do so. And as always, have a good one, fans. For the system's touch, whoa Look at his finest, your highness German president, your highness Wait, I'm here to slay the demons that haunt us Taunt us, join us, the time is upon us Hold the game, just hold my PS5 I do it for my soul, so with the BS5 Me and Rev, don't show who's me as zone The whole game is off, use me as zone